Uh, my name is Andrew Cleveland. I'm a sophomore transfer student at Clemson. And the uh, new student dialogue I attended was 10 years after 9-11. Uh, dialogue on religious pluralism in the United States and basically what our dialogue was about is how religion has been affected since September 11th and how many people have placed blame on certain religious groups for 9-11 and just basically how religion has evolved since then and what the effects have, have been as a whole on all religions in this country. And our, our dialogue, really I thought that there were uh, extreme opinions either way. There weren't really, there wasn't really a middle ground about it. Most people felt really strongly one way or the other. Particularly, I thought the uh, the group leaders were very opinionated, which I I agree with. Their, they have their opinions, but for something like that, they should have been more more in the middle, and it should have been much more moderate, not not extreme one way or the other. With how how it was, and so I, I felt that that was kind of kind of inhibited, per, per prevented the dialogue from really being successful for that very reason. But um, overall, it was it was rather productive. We just about everyone in the group spoke some. There, of course, you had the the few people who dominated the discussion and were very opinionated and just liked to hear themselves talk. And then the people who, like myself, who uh, didn't say very much and just kind of sat back and enjoyed the ride. But um, I, I think we achieved dialogue for the most part. I mean, the the leaders, even though they were very opinionated, they did a lot of things to get us to get us involved. And we uh, we uh, we went to a piece of paper on the wall and wrote down how religion has changed throughout our lives from the time we were born to where we are now and uh, things like that and it really got got the people involved and anytime you do something like this you're gonna have people who don't talk a lot and people that won't stop talking so for considering the circumstances yeah, we we pretty much had dialogue I wouldn't say it was great but it was considering the setting it was it was, it was pretty good but um yeah, and there were of course there were active voices in the group there were were certain people who were very opinionated, and they uh, they would answer, they would respond to every question. And then there were people like me who we I only said I responded to things that I felt really strongly about. And then there were some people in the room who said maybe two words the whole time, and you could just tell they aren't very comfortable talking. But that's that's what you're going to get in these kinds of in these kinds of things. And yeah, there were. There weren't that many reserved voices, but there were a few, and there were, some, like I said, there were some people who didn't say hard, hardly anything at all, and they were very reserved, and you could just tell that they weren't comfortable talking about that. And being religion, it's kind of a controversial topic to a lot of people, and a lot of people don't want to really get into their opinions and views on religion because it can be very controversial, and it can, you can say things that'll hurt people's feelings, and you can say things that are offensive. So a lot of people like myself don't really want to get that involved in a religious argument because a lot of th things can come from it that may be unexpected. And I, I would say in the group I was more in the middle ground from active and reserved. I didn't I didn't speak much that that much but then again I said some things when I felt real strongly but I uh, I was definitely not reserved but like I said there's a lot, a lot of things when you get into religion you don't really want to give all your opinions and beliefs on because it is going to cause some problems whether you want it to or not. It's religion. It's very. You're, you're going to make people mad with things you say, but that's that's one of the problems with having all these religions in a centralized place like the United States. It, it's there's going to be argument. There's going to be controversy. It's just something something that's going to happen. And that and the dialogue really really helped me to see that and see that someone just like just like me could have totally different opinions but aside from that there's still there's still a person and you can't really get into it that much but overall I feel that it was a very productive experience and I learned a good bit about dialogue and and uh, what it can do for me while I'm a student here at Clemson but 
if I would change some thing, if I could change some things, I would maybe get leaders who were a little less biased one way or the other, and maybe make it a little bit shorter because two hours is a pretty long time when I don't think really anybody wanted to be there. So it could have been condensed. Um, but overall, it was a it was a pretty good experience, and uh, I think that's it. Thank you.